I'm joined now by Dr. Christine Chung. She is the ISMRM Program Chair. Thank you so much for joining me, Christine. It's my pleasure. So you've been busy setting up for this year's meeting? We have been busy, yeah. Actually, the planning of this conference takes two years from start to finish. So we start doing education for this conference a year prior. And then we also have scientific offerings as well as lectures from luminaries in the field and people that we feel are going to offer new developments to you know, the attendees and registrants. Wow. Yeah. Who really stands out this year or what is standing out this year? Um, I think this year we switched the focus a little bit of the general theme of the meeting to one of community and diversity within the community. So the ISMRM is a society that includes PhDs and scientists. Um, we also have a big MD contingent and physician scientists as well. We have technologists who attend our meeting, students of all sorts. And so we tried to kind of focus not so much on a location or destination as something to highlight for the attendees as well as the science but really on the community the diversity of the community and um, different offerings that we're having so I think maybe the standouts this year might be our plenary sessions where we're focusing on big data which is you know huge for obviously imaging and imaging technology and science we're also looking at interesting new developments technologically so there will be some offerings on trying to image um, and imaging challenges imaging around metal for instance or with patients who have implanted devices who provide problems um, with regard to diagnosis for getting into an MRI scanner because of magnetic field so some of these are interesting from the standpoint that it really requires the clinician and the the scientist to come together to solve them treat the patient well um, and then also traumatic brain injury, things that are diseases or pathology um, that's really come to light and become um, popularized uh, maybe in the, um, in the, in the, the um, common literature and, and newspapers and things like that. You mentioned community. How important is it you know, for everyone to come together? Does it sort of re-energize people? Absolutely. So you know, I guess in a technological society where a lot is done through electronic correspondence and through Skype, um, this meeting is still small enough that we can come together um, you know, see each other, have face-to-face -face discussions, and I really think that that provides a different energy and a different type of collaboration, a different type of communication. So it's really been great for the society. Well, good luck with the rest of the conference. Thanks. Thank you so much, Dr. Christine Thank Chuck. you. Thanks. It's a pleasure.